Hey folks, it's a beautiful uh, day today. Nice Colorado weather. Um, snow's gone, it's not wet. And I wanted to run this. This is a Glock 17 Gen 4. It's running uh, Hollow Sun um, 407C with the green dot. And uh, it's got a uh, Brownells RMR slide. And um, I'm just going to see how this bad boy runs. Uh, I've also got some night vision uh, uh, sights on there so I can co-witness. Um, and we're just going to have a little bit of fun and see how how this guy runs. All right. All right, let's try a 25 yard warm up. I sighted this in with a red dot or with a laser um, cartridge. So I want to see where where that hit. Where that puts me. Let's see here. Well, you didn't like that round. Must have a dud there. Can't tell if I'm going high or low. Looks like they're coming in a little bit low. I'll bring it up just a tad and see where, where it's hitting here. Wow, I'm getting some bad rounds here. Well, I put in a different striker spring and I think I'm having some challenges with light primer strikes because of that, but we'll work our way through this. Let's, uh, let's do a drill from here, see where we're hitting. Well, gotta get the hole. Not my normal holster either. Wow. First two shots went high. I felt that. This was earlier. Not good. Time is 475 too. That guy, time on red dot guy. I struggle with these things. Let's see what we get from here. Here's another one. White primer. Maybe I shouldn't worry so much about red dots. Well, I think my ghost uh, striker spring is causing some light primer strikes, so I'm going to go back to factory for that when I get home. But uh, put some more rounds through this. But one of the things I, I'm not even using my regular holster, I'm using a Phobos Glock 30 holster because my old blade tech would not fit these raised sights. Um, so I have a CompTAC International on order. Be here sometime this year, hopefully. Um, but anyway, uh, guns shooting okay, except for the light primer strikes. So we'll just keep having fun. Here at 25 and just see where, where this dot's taking me.
interesting. off camera because I adjusted it back at 25 oh man okay so when I slow the freak down um, they're good I drill from up close two alpha alpha Charlie Two Alpha Alpha Charlie. I'm going real close just for fun. Two point four four seconds. I can catch the last time dark on it. But two two Charlies, two Alphas, two Alphas, two Alphas retreating. Here we go. From right to left. Mag change. Oh, light primer strike got me. 873. Got hit. Alpha Charlie. Charlie, oh, Charlie. Alpha Charlie. Uh, alpha 2 Charlie. I'll call that an Alpha 2 Alpha 1 Charlie. Here we go. That got me. Well, nine seconds. But, damn. Six Charlies, four Elses. Let's just see where those hit if I'm not going fast. Because I want to see if I'm hitting good spots. Trying to shoot with both eyes open. Well, that's going to get me. Got to switch that spring out. So if I'm not under time, I can get them all in the square. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm going to finish off about 9 rounds from 25 just to see if I'm doing any better. I was running some 124 grain or 147 grain hand loads. 3.9 grains are unique. These are 124 grain. Uh, I think you say Fioki, but I can't ever say it right. Um, and then I'm going to run... Now these are not Federal Premiums, but these are um, Reman brass with uh, HST bullets that were pulled. Um, these were come, come from uh, American Reloading, so we're going to see how those all run through this pistol. Seven. Alpha Charlie, Alpha Charlie, two Charlie, <laughs> two Delta. I saw those low go low. Alpha 
Charlie. Charlie Delta, Alpha Charlie. Alpha Charlie. 124 Grinners, let's go. Two alpha, two alpha, two alpha, alpha Charlie. Five, five twenty one. Alpha Charlie, two Charlie, two Alpha, two Alpha. Like ten yards. I'll just see if I can do headshots with this dot. Five twenty-one. Those headshots went low. That's kind of what I thought was going on here. Let's try that again. Okay. <laughs> Those definitely all sun adjustments here. Let's see. Yep. That's where I need to go. About a a one twenty fours. For this pistol so I'm just gonna do headshot from this distance which is a little closer it's probably about five or six yards in HST bullets, 139, uh, sorry, 147 to 150, or somewhere in that range. I think they're they're slightly uh, blemished. And um, what do I have for powder? 3.9 grains of unique. Just want to see what they're what they're gonna do. Come on, you don't get to waste an HST shot there. Guess you do. Okay, at 15, with three headshots. Uh, one went in the A, the other two were a little lower. All my, uh, at 20 yards, all of my uh, other shots were in the A zone. For duty carry. All right, we're gonna do the Glock again with Steve with these HSTs. Well, he doesn't have fun with these rounds, but I mean, he shoots them good. Holy 
cow. chamber Here we go. All right folks. So we are done. That's just about 250 rounds minus a few I'm going to chrono. Um we uh, tested the gun as you can see that last uh, 25 yard got just about everything in that center mass up there towards the top of the head that is a, uh, a half silhouette or a quarter silhouette half silhouette I think of those on the right and uh, I think it's even less than half it's a third um, but anyways you can see all those shots in the center there are good hits the uh, Glock 17 Gen 4 with the um, Brown Owl's RMR cut slide and the Hollow Sun 407C X2 with the green red dot are all ready to go. Just got to replace that striker spring, the Ghost one, with a uh, stock so I get reliable ignition and it is ready for carry. So, uh, good day out here with the Glock 17.